Do you want to start a website and don't know how? Well, I'm here to help show you the way. My name is Kyle from FinancialWolves.com, and I run a side hustle blog focused on all things online economy and gig economy. I'm obsessed with making money online and making uh, money when I want uh, and where I want to do it. Um, I, I think the concept of the, the gig economy and online economy is extremely fascinating um, to me and uh, an example, a great example is uh, a building a niche website where you, can, in the matter of 15 minutes, you can become an online business owner and run your own um, your own business um, from any uh, location around the world. So, with that being said, right, it's no surprise that my favorite side hustle out of them all is is blogging um, and the creation of niche websites, uh, particularly the creation of uh, niche websites on the WordPress platform. Uh, WordPress is the most customizable, um, easy to use uh, uh, platform for you to start even beginners and even experts to start a website of all sorts. Um, a lot of people think w when you see WordPress, you think uh, blogging only, or uh, that's not, that's actually not true at all. Uh, WordPress is uh, used in a variety of forms, whether that be e-commerce, um, software as a service businesses, uh, simple uh, search or database type websites, um, as well as uh, uh, membership based platforms where you have chats and forums. Um, it, it's it's a really a do it all platform and uh, I would recommend everyone uh, use it uh, for building a website just solely due to the customizability. Um, and that's the beauty of why I like blogging as well and we'll get to that in a second is that you can you can really start a blog and and have that be your foundation, but there are no limits for you to migrate into different angles, whether that be a me membership site, sell e-commerce goods, uh, digital products, uh, start a you know a software that you th that you'll sell through your blog. Um, so, with this uh, tutorial, I'll give you a step-by-step -step instruction on how to exactly create a, a website, particularly with Bluehost. Um, you, you might ask yourself, why Bluehost? Well, Bluehost is my favorite. Uh, hosting provider of choice, particularly for beginner bloggers. Um, it's the exact hosting provider that I used to scale um, my first two websites that were eventually acquired. Um, and I you know, grew them to uh, multiple hundred thousand page views per month and even did it while still being on, on Bluehost. Um, not only that, Bluehost is uh, has great customer service. They have excellent, excellent site speed for, particularly for the price, and offer some amazing bonuses just for signing up. Um, a few things to note. First, you can start a site for as low as $3.95 a month, and sometimes even Bluehost will offer a special for $2.95 uh, a month. Uh, second, they will assist you in your WordPress install for free. It's just a simple one-click WordPress install, and you're ready to go. Um, you'll also get a free uh, SSL certificate included in your hosting package. But then most importantly, um, you get a free domain name along the way. So just think about a all-encompassing uh, hosting provider where uh, you can, with one, with just a couple clicks, you can have your website up and ready uh, with your dom brandable domain name, among other um, uh, features. And so it's really a, it's a, it's a all-in-one package that um, uh, that they offer. And I highly suggest that uh, that you use Bluehost to build uh, a website or blog. So. After scaling a number of different websites and blogs, I guess, why should we be doing this? Um, you know, th to me, there's a ton of benefits by starting your own website or, or blog. Um, first, I think a lot of people should, um, you know, I think every person out there should have a, a blog. You already post a ton of different things on your social media accounts. Uh, you likely know information about a particular subject. Um, so why not uh, convey that message through case studies or um, how-to guides and show others um, how to do something or let others learn from your skill set uh, through real world examples. But not only that, for me, uh, building a website and a blog fits all the criteria I'm looking for with a side hustle. Um, the first being autonomy. Starting a website means I'm the owner and I'm the one calling the shots. That's pretty cool when you can do that, you know, in the matter of 15 minutes, uh, go from um, a person behind a computer to uh, a business owner uh, with a full brand and uh, a full uh, website to convey your your message. The second is flexibility. Blogs and websites can be worked on whenever and wherever you'd like uh, around the world. All you need is a laptop and uh, you're good to go and you can do a number of different things with your laptop and your website to navigate uh, um, your, your ultimate end goal. Um, finally, 
a website and a blog, either or can be a passive income sort of opportunity or or even a full-fledged online business. Really, the options are endless when it comes to blogging and, and building websites. Um, you can create it into a full online business where um, this now becomes your full career, your main focus um, to sell either digital products or uh, guides or um, your ebook or a variety of different things, right? Um, otherwise, I mean, you can take the passive income route. You can create a website uh, that produces content and has a handful of display ads, um, maybe some affiliate marketing, and you produce a handful of different a handful of different blog posts and articles that can help people uh, make better decisions about products and um, and uh, learn uh, about particular topics that you're knowledgeable in. Um, for that to happen, though, you know, for, to make passive income real, you do have to automate your process in some way, um, uh, you know, smooth out the kinks. But once you do figure that out and have an automated process, it's basically set it and forget it. So uh, a number of different options that you can take with uh, starting a, a website or a blog. So now after I gave you just a kind of a perspective and an intro on what uh, what we're doing here and, and why um, I do love Bluehost, um, let's get into the good stuff. Um, let's get into the exact tutorial of how I'm going to set up a website uh, with Bluehost in just a, a matter of a few, few steps. Okay, the first thing that you'll want to do is migrate over to Bluehost. Um, you, I've placed a handy link in the video description for you to just jump right in. Um, and you'll get to the landing page of Bluehost where um, you'll see exactly the, the starting uh, $395 a, a month um, to get started and start building your, your website. So there's a handful of different options out there for you to choose from as it relates to uh, Bluehost and the hosting packages. Um, through, you know, th through the landing page, there's a number of different discounts uh, for, for starting your blog on, on Bluehost. Um, you know, if you're cost constrained, I would start with just a simple basic package at $3.95 a month. Um, it just includes one website and all the uh, benefits that I outlined earlier in the video, such as, you know, a free domain, uh, free SSL uh, certificate, as well as uh, the one-click install on WordPress. For me, I did start mine under the plus package right here um, because I knew I wanted a number of different websites you can actually just fold in new domains that you acquire to create your next website. And so I wanted that unlimited um, capability. So it was a little bit more expensive. If you're, you're cost um, conscious at the moment, start with the basic. Um, it's a it's a good, good option to kind of uh, feel out uh, the whole concept of building a website and, and building a blog. Um, and it's not gonna cost you a fortune to get started. So I'm gonna select basic. So here you you'll you'll land on a um, you'll land on a page that will allow you to pick a domain name. Um, so this is where your chance to get a free domain name. You can just kind of you can punt to uh, getting your domain name later on um, and setting up just more of the WordPress install at, uh, right away, and and then figure out your domain name if you're not ready. If you're looking for tips on how to choose your domain name, I would highly suggest a few things. The first being choose a .com uh, domain name. The second, choose something that's brandable, that can be remembered by your audience. Um, most of your readers were, are only going to spend uh, you know, one time on, on your site and they'll likely forget about you in the, in the future. Um, so what you need is, is as many opportunities as you can to uh, make your site memorable. And so something that's branded, something that gives you a personal spin or a personal angle. Uh, think of the large websites that were started on WordPress, like the points guy. Um, uh, that's a that's a great example, right, of um, his sort of angle in his um, particular sub niche and his topics that he wanted to help others uh, choose uh, choose the best credit cards. Uh, the final, final point with considering with uh, uh, choosing a domain name is having it be short and um, have it being short, no numbers, no dashes, just keep it to, you know, as short as possible, simple, sleek, and punchy. So for, for me, I am going to, you know, here you would normally type in, you know, my super awesome niche website.com. For me, I already have a domain name ready to go where I will um, add it to my account. 
So I'm going to skip this for now. So you're probably wondering under the basic plan for hosting, you know, what option should you choose? Uh, choose something that does not include any additional add-ons. Um, you might want to just consider a one-year package. You'll get the best rate if you do three years. One year on, under the basic package is $5.95 a month versus three. Three years is $3.95 a month. Um, you get the best bang for your buck if you go to three years. It gives you a long runway for starting your website and navigating your plan to, to growing your website. Um, so, but I would either do one or three. So one, it'll, it'll only cost $71 to start your website, um, which is, which is excellent. Um, and, and it'll give you an opportunity under a one year window to just try out, uh, the whole concept of blogging and starting a website. Um, so I'm going to select three, three years, 395 a month. Now you'll have to fill in your contact information. Um, here I'll let, uh, I'll let you breeze through. It's the typical billing information. And the best part is you can pay either through Visa or even just your PayPal account. Okay, so now that I have all my information set up in here, I am going to hit purchase now. Okay, so now we're at the point where we want to create our website. You'll likely, after you purchase the hosting, you'll have to set a password, log into your account, and then um, now you're at the stage where you're going to create the exact website that you want. For me, I like blogging rather than online store or business or portfolio service portfolio. I like creating just a blog. Um, let's just say it's for, it's personal, and I'm creating it for myself. Um, blog, you can just continue here. My super cool niche website, the best website ever. Okay, here's a handful of different themes that you can select. Um, these are all free, which is excellent. Um, for me, an expert um, expert bloggers and other individuals that, you know, I suggest you use a generate press theme or, um, Genesis. The Genesis framework is going to be a paid theme. Um, you'll have to set up a, a main framework and then put on a, a child theme to, uh, to build out your website and design your website. But I think if you're just starting out a free theme is, um, is a great choice. It's simple. Uh, it's easy to get started. It'll allow you to understand and get a feel for uh, WordPress customization. Um, so I selected uh, Generate Press. So now give Bluehost just a moment to install WordPress within the hosting uh, network. You'll also get a site um, you also get a, access to the Cloudflare CDN, which is a content delivery network where you can um, speed up your site through additional server access. Here is uh, your first dashboard for starting uh, your, your blog and launching your site. Um, I'll click the WordPress. Okay, so now that you have your website set up and accessed into WordPress, um, you can see here's my super cool niche website. Um, you'll see a bunch of different pop-ups um, information in, within your WordPress dashboard. This is the standard WordPress dashboard. Um, you'll see that the theme I selected is here and activated. There's also a handful of other templated themes that you can use. Um, I suggest since you, uh, they'll since Bluehost will give you uh, a theme directly in their platform, I would suggest that you use and keep with and maintain 
the existing theme you have um, through through Bluehost. So you have a number of different plugin options that you can use. Uh, it'll come with a handful of uh, a handful of follow-on plugins, things like anti-spam. I would suggest selecting a Kismet. Um, you'll need to set up a API key and set up the a Kismet account. Um, but with your basic WordPress install, you'll have a Kismet. You'll have the Bluehost plugin, Google Analytics, Jetpack, Optin Monster for uh, email list growth uh, through pop-ups, forms, floating bars, and more, and then as well as uh, WP forms. So there you have it. This is how you set up a WordPress website through Bluehost. It's very straightforward. It's very easy. Um, now that I have my Generate Press theme set up, I can go ahead and start writing my first blog post and get started. So there you have it. That's how you install a website on WordPress with Bluehost. Uh, this simple step-by-step -step guide shows you exactly why Bluehost is best in breed for starting a website in a matter of minutes. Stay tuned with other updates and thanks for watching. If you liked our video, leave us a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe and click on the notification bell to get informed of our new videos. Also, in the comments, I included a free audience builder course to help you build and grow your email list.